bro. I am at the coffee shop. Where are you? What shall we order? What will be nice in this place? Hey, I not even completed my assignment yet. Hey, I am going to pre wedding shoot tomorrow. Hello? Yeah, yeah, yes, sir. Yeah, I am doing it. I am working on it. So you were supposed to call me tomorrow, no? Why are you calling me today? Yeah, today five p.m. Yeah, I'll be there. I'll be there. I'll send it to you by end of the day. Okay. Hey Shelly, what happened? Anything serious? You know, life is not at all peaceful for me. I've been so stressed, and this office work—they're stressing me out. Like, oh my God, I cannot handle this anymore. It's like I'm wearing a mask. I'm pretending to be someone else. Like I'm totally stressed. I don't know what to do. Is this your problem? I thought something serious would have happened. See, listen. I'll tell you a short story. I know a friend who went to a mall. Nano or naal ipda mall ek jaliya pone. And that is how I also went to a mall uh, happily one day. Aunge alla olaga prar mana kariyan gal allam basi thunna. And they were talking all kinds of worldly things. Adalam solamatte. I will not mention any of those. The conversation enjoy pane la. Sorry. Sorry. Delhi va kikre. He did not enjoy the conversation. Mall er asi thunna orda tham. I was holiday just, rasi chitru. I was just enjoying the holiday and the uh, mall. Abdi poitru kumot dinne or tongo odi vandu rompa sandoshma adhe mari brother. ரொம்ப சந்தோஷம் உங்கள பார்த்தது என்று சொல்லி வந்தாங்க so i was i was walking along uh, a brother came uh, up to me and said lord brother i'm so happy to have seen you mulu kudumathiyum ellari kudit vandanga he immediately brought his entire family to me my friends ellak pinadi in the comment solite irundanu nalla and uh, all my friends were commenting uh, from behind me appe onna na vande pesit irukumode ala aramichita and as they were even uh, talking to me they began to cry yeah wait la avlo sovena thoda irukkar en kanavar endru solli they uh, said uh, my husband is so sick at home ayyo nalla vela enikku ungala paathen jomanunga please endru kettaanga they uh, asked you know they said it was so it is so good that i have seen you today would you please pray for me veliya pogum bolidum chumma pogum bolidum andavare nee varum daiva senju varum endru solli as i uh, you know went out i said lord please come with me wherever i go enna vittu vidadiram please do not leave me naan ummai vittu vidadapadi ennai maatram change me that i may not leave you oru ovvoru nodi podidilum nam jaakirudhaya irupom let us be very careful every moment in our lives see you don't have to wear a mask every time god will accept the way you are it is heart that matters okay Let me ask you something. That person came to the mall, right? That's why Sam and I prayed for him, and he found out his true nature. But what if that person didn't come to the mall that day? Parents, they'd say, "Cut your hair. I don't want you to grow your hair to be a long hair, or I, wa- I don't want you to dress like this." So all these things there'd be clash. I know better for what I need for my life. How can you say that you don't even know me? You you can't know my life. so i would go angry and go to my room and i'll be in a angry mood regarding my parents that suddenly the holy spirit's small voice would come within me saying don't worry relax just yield to what they are saying and i'll bless you for it you will see a great blessing when you just obey what they are saying it is needed for your life now say go back to my parents and say i am sorry i will do it and i will follow it because of that one simple obedience he would have taken me to a higher level and you will start to only know the difference when you feel the holy spirit in your heart otherwise you'll never know what is bad for you what is worldly thing what is godly thing Now the Lord is moving into every young person into every little child into every elder who's calling to his name his love is shining upon you Okay okay I'll follow godly nature now but will I be able to continue to follow this after my marriage It's a time when we really need to be patient in listening uh, to each other and to bear each other in mm. love. 
we also need to adapt to each other mm -hmm. we have our our own preferences our own needs we push that agenda all the time and we don't focus on the other person in what they would want or how we need to adjust to them mm -hmm. many don't take the time we're always selfish in thinking about us mm -hmm. isn't it yeah that's true and uh, one more thing is it's so important for us to respect our spouse mm -hmm. only when you respect then we will try to adapt because i respect you i will adapt to your schedule or because you respect me you adapt to my schedule so respecting each other's spouse it's so important see god will teach us all the things in our lives even in this generation it is very hard to live a pure life sam anna sets an example for all of us even on this day we are very happy to wish him my precious son sam happy 33rd birthday Even during this birthday the prayer of Jabez will come true in your life. God will bless you with his special blessing and you will carry the blessing not only for yourself but for the family and the ministry family too. And the Lord will enlarge your territory. Happy birthday once again. Happy birthday to you. Love you. Eat with you.